The Australian Government has introduced world first legislation to actually bring about the plain packaging of all tobacco products in our country. The tobacco companies are fighting us in our endeavour. They have brought action in our High Court, legal action. They have lobbied politically, they have advertised in newspapers and they have also tried to slow my officials down in the work that they do in tobacco control. All of these actions are designed to try and intimidate the Australian Government and Australian officials to actually ask us to relent in our efforts to protect the public health of our citizens. It's really important that we stand globally shoulder to shoulder in this fight and it's really important that we understand the tactics that are used by tobacco to make us water down or indeed relent in our legitimate efforts to protect the health of our citizens. So I encourage you to talk to your colleagues to understand what is going on in relation to the efforts of Big Tobacco and importantly not to waver in the implementation of the Framework Convention on Tobacco Control. I am aware of the fact that all member states of the World Health Organization, including my own country, Namibia, as we stand today in the fight against tobacco smoking, as we stand to get today together in defense of our piece of legislation, tobacco smoking should not be allowed in all the public institutions, in taxis, in buses, in schools, in hospitals, in clinics, you name it. Let us together with all our development partners, the WHO, UNICEF, UNFPA, all progress men and women, let us stand together and fight the tobacco industry. Here in Namibia, let us stand together and fight the British American tobacco industry. Let us do all we can as government no amount of pressure should stop us from protecting our people from non-communicable diseases. Tobacco industry has taken Norway to court only because we are implementing the WHO Tobacco Convention. This is totally unacceptable. In my view, people's health is more important than profit for the tobacco industry. We are prepared to fight big tobacco in court and will mobilize all necessary resources to do so. When the tobacco industry can take my country to court today, it may be your country's turn tomorrow. The WHO Framework Convention unites all parties and empowers us to move forward in tobacco control activities. Nosotros hemos tenido una lucha internacional y una nacional. La internacional es el juicio que tiene Uruguay frente a la Philip Morris. La nacional ha sido la industria tabacalera del país que ha enfrentado también a una determinación y una ley que nos permite tener 100% fuera de humo de tabaco en los lugares cerrados, bajar la prevalencia y la incidencia en las enfermedades cardiovasculares y neoplásicas. Sabemos que estamos frente a un enemigo muy poderoso que es la industria del tabaco, pero estamos conscientes de que el derecho a la salud y el derecho a la determinación de las políticas de salud de Estado es un derecho para el bienestar de nuestra población. As Director General of the World Health Organization, I have only one position, and the position is to fight the tobacco industry 
in the most vigorous manner possible, and with the support of all my member states, no. 194 of them.